Well, it, there's a wake-up call for parents who've bought their kids VTech educational toys. VTech got hacked last year. In fact, the details of millions of customers got stolen. Not just customers, but also over 4 million children's details, including photographs, their names, their ages. And the hackers were even able to link this up with where those children might live. Not very good news. And of course, VTech has sprung into action to deal with this. And what did they do? They got the lawyers in. And they got the lawyers in to change the terms and conditions. Let's take a look at what the terms and conditions on the VTech site are now saying. And it says, you acknowledge and agree that any information you send or receive during your use of the site may not be secure and may be intercepted or later acquired by unauthorised parties. The executive summary? Sod the kids. The lawyers have covered our asses. And you know what? That kind of attitude doesn't fill me with any confidence at all that VTech has really learned its lesson, that it's embraced security and privacy, which is what it should do. You know, companies are getting hacked all of the time. And there will be many, many firms into the future who will be caught with their pants around their ankles after an embarrassing data security incident. But what's important is how companies respond to the security incident. Are they open? Are they transparent? Do they put their hands up and say, yes, you know, we cocked up on this occasion? Do they embrace security and say, you know, from now on, we are going to integrate security from the beginning. We're going to look at everything and make sure it's secure because it's so important that we don't leak our users' details ever again. Or do they call in the lawyers to rewrite the terms and conditions? It's a difficult choice, isn't it? But VTech seems to have made that choice. And now it's up to parents to make their choice as well. Are you going to carry on buying VTech products? Or will you take your cash somewhere else? Oh, and by the way, it's not just electronic toys that VTech sell. They're also rather keen to protect your homes with monitoring systems or put gadgetry into business as well. Makes you think, doesn't it? I hope so. Thanks for watching, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to like it and check out some of the other videos I've made as well. And if you really want me to make more vids, then subscribe to my channel. All right. So, have you subscribed yet? Come on, subscribe.